So can you please explain uh, your experience or the results after enrolling your son into sports nutrition? Uh, well, the results can be mentioned basically in, in a night and day difference uh, because the kind of difference that was shown on my son was very huge. Uh, we were earlier also giving him the similar kind of diet what Ryan had actually is, uh, prescribed us, but we were not organized. We were actually not aware as to what is to be given at the right time, what was something to be given pre-workout and post-workout. So now we are more organized and uh, you know the results are showing. So yeah. what was the result of the blood test? See the, uh, the blood test results were... Uh, hemoglobin uh, his hemoglobin percentage was very less and his okay. vitamin B3 levels were very less. Okay. And uh, we, we basically enrolled into this program thinking that you know we want to enhance his performance at the same time we want to look into his health also. So that's how we did it and then the blood test actually told us as to where we stand. So now since we are being on the diet and then everything is controlled and regulated, his hemoglobin count has come up. What was his previous hemoglobin count and what is the present one? So he started one? with 9.6, went to 11, now it's coming at 13. 13, okay. That's really good. The one more thing is very important thing is that Roshan, he was a healthy child from childhood. But then uh, after he joined swimming, he was feeling very tired after his workout and after his swimming. And as the months passed, he was like, uh, it was going down his head. And we could see that there was some deficiency because there were some patches on his face. Then he was constantly getting loose motions. Okay. All that stopped, I think, like 15 days after the diet, everything was in control. Oh, that's good. That's good. And then he is more energetic now than before. Than before. That's weird. Okay. Very much. So, uh, did the nutrition say what was the cause for his hemoglobin count to come down? Basically, it was uh, iron content, lack of iron content, and uh, that's it. Uh, basically, and then his food habits, uh, which you know he had a lot of things which was having preservatives. Uh, okay. Dependent, he was very much addicted to having sauces and uh, cold rings which were having preservatives. So all this probably could have, uh, you know, come to a situation where he was having his iron content deficiency in, in his iron. So ever since the nutrition program was put into place, uh, he stopped having all these things. And uh, now he's, uh, you know, he's peaking in his performance and it shows in his performance. Question, uh, how easy or difficult it is for you to follow the nutrition plan devised by our uh, nutritionists? When I saw the chart, I felt it would be very difficult for me to follow. But then no, later on, like it was, it became easy because first they asked us what we are used to eating every day, and they planned the chart according to our type of food in the okay. beginning. So then slowly they introduced uh, other continental dishes, so it was easier for me to get into. So basically, they first stuck to the normal food which you yes, normally yes, eat, yes. and then they, they slowly gave time, came, yeah. okay, they slowly upgraded you yeah. to uh, different food so that he can survive in any other state yes, he goes in yes, place. Yes. Okay, Roshan, so are you enjoying the uh, nutrition diet or, or the sports sports nutrition diet which uh, the nutrition is giving you? Yes. So you are not feeling any difficulty in you know uh, following it? Yes. So sir, as a parent, what would be your message to uh, the parents of all the athletes in the country? Uh, invest into sports nutrition. It will do a world of good for your child. Uh, it will do a world of good for your well-being uh, and your mental well-being also. So when you see your child improving, and you find your child's health improving uh, and uh, you really cherish all those moments. Wow. And the progressive rate at which the child is improving will be cherished long, for long. Okay. Uh, I'm sure and I, as a parent and as a sports enthusiast, I would, I would request every single parent whose child is into uh, endurance sports or even so, even if it is into recreational sports, invest in the sports education. Thank you very much, sir.